I like to start first thing in the morning. There's something special about a hot cup of coffee, the stillness of an early morning, and a brew day ready to start. Brewing beer, even in small batches, takes a decent chunk of the day. Normally, I'll have everything ready to go beforehand, weigh out my grains, and run those through the mill to get them crushed. I'll also measure out my hops and separate and label those for how I'm going to use them during the brew day. And my brew house takes some prep as well. There's a lot of valves and clamps and different tubing to connect and look over before I'm ready to start the day. At its core, beer is a really simple thing. It's often over 95% water and the rest is just malted barley, hops, and yeast. How you use and combine those ingredients, that's the tricky part. This step right here is called the mash. I'm mixing my crushed barley and other grains in hot water so that they can steep. And what we're doing is converting these starches and other components within the grain into a sweet liquid called wort. This liquid, or wort, is what we will later boil and add our hops to before it ferments into beer. I don't want anyone to think that I'm some master brewer, because I'm not. The science of beer is incredibly complex. I've been brewing beer for many years now, and there is still some beers that I'll make that after the fact I'll wonder, what the heck was I thinking? Adding a certain grain to the recipe or making a certain change to my process. But honestly, that's one of the cool things about brewing beer. Experimenting with different yeast and hop combinations, adjusting your process to try to dial in a beer and get it just right. That's the fun part. The key though is to always keep learning, take good notes so you can evaluate what you've done and then make improvements for next time. It's a very scientific process. As a mechanical engineer, that's one of the main aspects I love most about creating my own beers. There's some chemistry, a little physics, and even some biological processes going on. Everything from temperature, pressure, pH, time, they're all critical aspects of beer production. And very small changes can make big differences in the final beer. Brute is only one small part of the process. The real magic happens when yeast is added to the wort. There's this saying in the beer industry that brewers make wort, but yeast make beer. Brewing quality craft beer is truly a labor of love. It's all about fresh, quality ingredients, attention to detail, and hard, hard work. I've never seen anyone work harder than my dad. Anything he has ever done was always with his whole heart and just pure relentlessness. There was no such thing as bending the rules or cutting corners in the Carter house. It didn't happen. Those are qualities that I've always tried to put into my own beer. Of course, no one really likes the process of hard work, right? But sitting back and appreciating something that you know you've put your everything into, <laughs> It doesn't get any better. What would you say you love the most about beer? I'd say I love that beer is all about community. It's a craft that you put your heart and soul into with the ultimate goal of sharing it with the people you love. My name is Ryan Carter, and this is Craft Brewing on a Small Scale.